Hey Scorpio, I hope you all are doing well. This is going to be a general reading for May the 22nd through the 31st. Any information you all need, you can find it down below in the description box, okay? We're going to go ahead and begin here for you, Scorpio. If you guys hear any odd noises in the background, I do have both my sons sleeping, okay, behind me here. We have a car falling out. Um, and my dog is uh, sleeping across the room here. One, two, three, four, five, six. Okay, yeah, we have the right amount. Just wanted to make sure here. Scorpio. Wow, you have a lot of majors here, except for one, all right? Now, I mean, on the bottom of the deck, you do have an ace, ace of wands, all right? Fire, Aries, Sagittarius, and Leo. Now, I absolutely hate the way that this is going to sound, but this could also, I want you to keep in mind, Scorpio, this could be something in the headspace. It doesn't have to necessarily be that this was what was going on exactly, but you have the high priestess here. This is somebody who holds secrets, holds truth, holds like knowledge and wisdom, you know, of the other side. You have the magician here. This can be somebody who's practicing magic. You have the devil showing up as well. Okay. I don't know what that was. Anyways, um, you have the devil showing up as well. So, um, you know, I do feel like there's something going on here where you could have been experiencing like financial ruin or like tower after tower in situations that could have had to do with your money, your work. Um, that feels like the main focus here, but it could have had to do with another person, you know, maybe this affected your relationships here. And, you know, this could have just been a toxic energy that you were connected to. However, I do feel like some of you, you could have started to get the feeling that you were cursed, you know, and I think the star card is showing up here. So that's a good sign. Okay. And the ace of wands, it's almost like there's new magic here. Um, you know, it's almost like you are deciding that something is not going to affect you anymore, you know? So that's, that's. A power that you're holding at this point in time and you know i think that's something you're coming into i feel like you're healing okay with the star card showing up that's a card of healing renewal rebirth faith hope you know new directions new beginnings wishes being fulfilled and you know with this energy showing up here i feel like whatever healing you're doing like it's it's hitting very deep for you is how i'm feeling here okay with the star showing up um well i, I do want to clarify first so let me see Knight of Pentacles. Yeah, something was very slow moving. I feel like, you know, there could have been delays or blockages. And again, I feel like you could have been in a space where you were feeling like, you know, something was cursed or something was, um, what do you call it there exactly? Like, or you were like under some kind of spell. You could have been feeling this way, truly. You have the Queen of Pentacles showing up as well. You got a lot of Pentacles here. It could have been about work or money, but the world is showing up. I feel like that's a cycle that is closing for you. Like, if there was some kind of curse, it is lifted. And I feel like it's it's happening through your healing, though. You know, it's like, as you heal, and this is what I was getting before I clarified, too. You're clearing major blockages that have been here for a very long time. Four Pentacles. Um, a lot of you, like, the heart space, the head space. You know, the way that you were viewing yourself. The way that you were, um, you know, showing love and compassion to others others. I feel like things are changing here for you in regards to those things, right? Because he's got the pinnacle clutched over his heart space. For those of you where you are feeling those blockages, work with the color green, okay? He's got this um, in the color white. He's got this up at his crown, right? Uh, which can signify somebody who cannot see how grand they are. Obviously, he can't see that pinnacle up there. And, you know, I think you could have been in this space for a long, long time. And, you know, you're being introduced to a new energy here. Like, that's how this is feeling to me. Like, you're healing blockages, like I said. And it feels like it could have been very slow-moving energy for a long time. And now that you're doing this healing, you're doing this work, it's almost like you are clearing up space on accident in a way. You know, it's like you aim to heal from something else and you heal even deeper wounds. Like you start to make connections on an intuitive level here, Scorpio. Let's see what else we have. Yeah, you're like you're looking back on other decisions here. You're waking up to, um, you know, a lot of the ways that you've been played and a lot of the ways that you've played yourself, Scorpio. Four of Pentacles is showing up, yeah. By holding back your gifts, for some of you, by staying in situations that were just familiar to you. Page of Cups is showing up, though. I feel like you could be getting a message here, Ace of Pentacles. Yeah, two Aces showing up, Page of Pentacles. A lot of messages coming in. Four of Wands. You're having a lot of success here, Scorpio. King of Wands energy, Entrepreneur energy, Ten of Wands. I feel like somebody else is kind of losing their you know what over this they're losing their mind we'll say their mind just you know for the sake of youtube making everybody keep things so pg here scorpio but yeah i do feel like somebody could be going crazy because you're having a lot of success you know despite um walking away from them i feel like you're dealing with an energy here who may have felt maybe an earth 
fire or water sign, somebody felt like, you know, you needed to be connected to them in order to have success. Everything you did or accomplished had to come from you being connected to them. And now you're not. You're away from that energy. And I feel like you are blossoming more like more than you ever have Scorpio with that ace of pentacles four of wands king of wands energy and I feel like there could be messages coming your way you know uh prepare for projection you know like <laughs> classic tactic here from folks like this but you know Scorpio I feel like you are doing much much better so keep looking ahead I feel like you are winning at life in the current energy and it looks fantastic okay that's what I'm saying I hope that this was helpful there are details down below for anyone who may be interested in a personal if you're interested in joining me over on Patreon on uh, Instagram if you want to check out my other channel. Everything's located below. But if this is where we part, thanks for watching this far. I really appreciate you and I hope I'll see you next time. Bye.